Scorpio, welcome to your weekly forecast for February 9th until 16th. Now let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. <clears throat> All right. Oh, good news. But you're feeling a little bit Oh, depressed. Well, Scorpio. You know, for those who's already in a relationship, you're, you know, you're, you, there's nothing that you can ask for. But, for the past few days or few nights, uh, this earth sign from your past, it keeps on popping up into your head or even or even into your dreams and you don't even know what to do with it because you know sometimes it's already driving you crazy now, now this week there will be good news and there is a uh, oh and one more thing there's also someone who's going to be delivering babies yeah babies as in like twins around you so i feel like you will be going to that uh, person's place not in the hospital but mostly in their place and uh, you'll be very happy being surrounded by you know by uh, kids or infants and this is something that you've been you know that you've been dreaming of having as well now now there is also like some things in the bank or you're waiting for a loan to be approved and you're just keeping this to yourself okay you want to use the money for a small business or small investment that you want to that you want to start and you don't want to you don't want to let your partner know about this because all you get is their negativities and their you know skepticism about your plans and you don't really want to hear that okay you want to take the risk how will you know if you're not gonna gamble or try it yourself okay so there will be some news that's going to be coming your way and um I feel like this is also the week where you will get approved for that loan that you're expecting or somehow <coughs> trying to get. But the main problem here is you don't know how to keep it from your partner because they're going to find out about that. And they, it's going to spark or it's going to start a fight. All right. Now, you will be working um, for longer hours and you want to earn extra okay for some reason i don't know why you needed you needed money so much like this and uh, you're already you know um you already have enough but you are feeling a little bit angsty and you're feeling a little bit um you know anxious about how your finances will go because it's been really slow for the past few months or past few weeks or year just days you know and you're wishing for some things to grow to to flourish and to outflow now, you're kind of stuck with this person from the past and even though it's been like three years or three to seven years already and no, actually three to, st three to eight years already, three, eight, three, seven or eight and you thought that you've already moved on from this person, you thought that you're, you know, done done with the memories and everything but then all of a sudden, every morning or even at night you'll wake up seeing this person in your dreams as much as you want to reach out to this person you don't have any more communication so all you can do right now is just keep on wondering and you keep on thinking about them okay you don't have any mode of communications no numbers no emails no whatsoever because i feel like this person have already changed everything so that you won't be able to contact them okay even their own numbers or their social medias or deleting their email addresses and <coughs> You will try to work on your fears and you will also try to work on yourself. But somehow, you feel like, you know, you feel like this person is trying to connect with you in a soul level for some reason. Now, for those Scorpios who's with uh, another water sign or another fire sign, you are trying to think 
okay or reconsider their offer but the thing here is there will be some secrets that you will discover and this will just hurt you and tear you apart that you will also say to yourself that ah, you know I've, I've made the right decision of moving away or i've made the right decision of really cutting off this person because all along that i've been leaving and i've been sleeping with an enemy okay or i've been sleeping with somebody who's been sabotaging me and now that this person is trying to woo me or trying to win me back just because that they feel guilty okay so there will be a lot of balancing and you're also you know you will be facing the crossroads whether you should reconsider this person or not or if you should just move on with your life you know what if you only want to be with this person financially or just because that you're so afraid that things in your life won't work out the way you want it to be fear not because this is just a phase this is just the beginning of the year for you okay and you can pull it through you can pull more out of it and you don't really need this person you don't you don't need another toxicity you don't need another lie another drama okay you have your own life to fix up and you have your own life or future to shape up okay so let's take a look at your oracle cards <clears throat> okay, blessed. Mm. Orphaned. Time for a nap. You haven't been sleeping. Okay, running around. Here we know. New life. Okay. You know, as I've said, that there are some things in your life that you just need to let go and have some faith. Okay, move on with your future, move on with your life, and keep on moving forward. You don't really need somebody to provide for you because you can definitely provide for yourself and you can definitely do this, you know, on your own. This person is the one who is actually needing you, not you. Now, sometimes you feel so alone and sometimes you feel like nobody is there, no, no, nobody's there for you, okay? Or nobody's ready to listen to you or, um, you know, like uh, give you some crying shoulders or a lending hand or something like that because um, you've been feeling so left alone for the past six months and you don't even know if you've really made the right decision of doing this or going to a place where you're in right now okay now you also need to relax a little bit and catch up some more sleep so that you'll be able to think the right way okay or don't um don't rush into anything at this point because if you will try to rush into making a decision then you will be making a lot of mistakes okay especially if you'll be thinking based on your emotions or if you'll be making a decision based on your emotions so it's not really going to work out the way you really want it to be you need to have a clear head now, there are some things in your life that just keeps on going over and over and over again. And it's because that you haven't really learned your lesson. And you also keep on repeating the same mistakes, same patterns, same behaviors. And you are trying to escape from a problem instead of facing it. It's time for you to stretch out a little bit and uh, welcome the new life and the new beginning that is coming your way real soon. It's time for you to leave the past behind and move on with your future and keep on moving forward okay because it seems like you are standing at a crossroads all right and yep <laughs> i pulled out for more clarifications and it seems like this is you know uh, the last message of the angels for you it's time for you to go if this person especially if you're dealing with a water or um, fire sign it's time for you to go and leave everything behind to face your new face your new life face your new beginnings don't be afraid you're guided and you're protected okay whatever happens whatever challenges that you will be facing you're not alone because someone is actually guiding you along the way and protecting you 
and this person especially if you're dealing with a fire sign this one is very selfish and they only want you back because they don't want to handle the uh, responsibilities alone okay so it's time for you to stretch out a little bit and um, you know wait for the new day to come all right so anyway that's it for you for this week scorpio and if you want to talk to me live on the phone or live video calls it's already right there in my website you just need to register to access it and um yeah you may um talk to me through that or uh, pre-recorded video readings all right and um get your personalized annual forecast for 2019 all right blessings to you and have a great weekend